one and Sammy Perez didn't bite, but she might have to now. Hit to hair. That's a sure thing when you hit it over there. Two out. Yeah, her fielding has just been so great this whole series, like we've been saying. Keep bringing her name up, but she's been so good on both. Hit hard to hair. Long throw in time. <laughs> we've talked about her all series long, but swings hard of the first pitch. To hair. Gets her in time. Really good defensive stop right there by Hare to eat that one up and then just fire one over there to get a speedy Bree Rodriguez. Alexandra Hare has probably been the best player in the series. Ripping that one into center field. And Monik able to cut it off before it reaches the fence. But you can see Alexandra Hare, half of the St. Leo offense. Hit hard into center field. That'll bring a runner home, Alexandra Hare. Continuing her production. And respond. Every game means a lot more now as you get in, into those SSC play, SSC games. Getting some early season tune-ups with a lot of northern teams coming from Colorado and Pennsylvania. And Monica gets over to the third base side, rocketed across the mat. Two outs, Bree Rodriguez still on second. And Bayer looking to start a nice little two-out rally for the Sailfishes. She can be dangerous in that five hole of the lineup with some sneaky power. And she puts that one in play, and man, oh man, Alexandra Hare with some of the quickest hands I've ever seen, making a snag and a half at third base. Great piece by Kendall Bayer. But Sailfish leave one on as they're still down 6-0, heading into the top of the fifth. Seven and one, their only losses to the Spring Hill College. And there's that offense rolling. 